So this question describes a triangle drawn on the 6x5 grid with one vertex on A and the other two on the top and the right hand boundary. The question is asking what is the largest number of squares that can be cut by the sides of such a triangle. So this refers to the number of squares, for example if you take this side, the number of squares which it cuts will be this square, this square, this square, this square, this square, and this square because this line or this side of the triangle passes through or cuts through all these squares. So this is what the question is asking. How, how can we draw this triangle such that the vertex are on A, top and right hand boundary such that it cuts the largest number of squares? So the concept here is that the more central the vertex is, all right, the more squares it will cut because the more the squares will zigzag. Let me illustrate by drawing this line in. If for example we draw this line, instead of drawing on the midpoint of this six, uh, six units grid, all right, we cut it a bit more. So we'll notice that the squares which this line cuts will be this square, this, 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 this square it cuts a little, all right, here, here, and here. So the more the square zigzags, the more squares, the more number of squares we will cut. Similarly, we apply that concept to this side. If we place this vertex in the center of this five unit grid, and we draw this line here, and then we join up this triangle, all right, so this will be the Optimum triangle which cuts the most number of squares from its sides. Now I'll shade in the remaining sides so that you can clearly see the number of squares which are cut. So all the squares which are shaded in are the squares which are cut by the side of the triangle. So now we can count the largest number of squares which will be 18. So our answer will be 18.